it's time for you all to meet Kazali, a demon whose ability reads, each night, choose a player, they die. You choose which players are which minions. Minus something to something, minus something to plus something outsiders. So, basically, on the first night, there are no de minions in the bag. You put Kazali and all goodies. Uh, and then on night one, before you give out minion and demon info, you wake up Kazali. Uh, and they choose who their minions are. Uh, this, of course, can take out outsiders that were already in the bag. Uh, uh, if, if they choose an outsider. Do you know what? Why am I explaining this? We've got Ed here. Ed, explain this. Uh, yeah, so um, the Kasali can make an infinite number of changes to outsider mods, um, which you know is, is intended for a reason. Uh, the main reason being that uh, there's a balance issue with um, with the demon choosing their minions, which we'll get to in a minute. Um, it's a bit easier for me to explain that at the other end of the description of the character. So I'm going to start with that end. Um, so the Kazali chooses their own minions. That's their ability, basically. They get to kill someone every night. That's what most demons do, but they get to choose their own minions. So when you put tokens in the bag, no minion tokens go in. On the first night, um, the Kazali get woken up and they will choose <clears throat> one at a time enough players that they would have minions and a minion character for that player to be. Specifically, they get to choose exactly which player is exactly which minion. So if they want to be sitting next to their spy, they can sit next to their spy. If they want you know, the vizier to be on the opposite side of the circle, they can make that happen. Um, you just repeat that until you've got the correct number of minions, and then for the rest of the game, the Ghazali is just the, the most simple demon that you ever need to run, because they just kill someone. That's pretty much it. Um, you need to be aware that this is where the balance thing comes in with the Outsiders, is if you add a bunch of Outsiders to a Ghazali game, and then the Ghazali randomly hits only Townsfolk, you've basically got a bunch of Outsiders and almost no Townsfolk. Um, if they randomly hit only Outsiders, then maybe you've got a bunch of townsfolk and no, out, no outsiders to, to counteract that. So you need to be wary of that. The important, the important thing about this is that the secondary power boost of the Kazali is that it gives every minion a bluff. Um, because every minion has drawn a token out of the bag, which was blue. Um, and then during the first night has been woken up and told, you are X minion, you are evil. So they have a bluff right off the bat. Right off the bat, they don't need to wait to talk to the Kazali. They don't need a snitch. They don't need anything else. They know that they have something completely safe to claim. Um, there's a couple of bits that are vague, sort of optional on this. Um, the storyteller can keep the Kazali awake when they wake the minions uh, to tell them that they've become minions. You can choose to do that. Obviously, you don't want to do that with poppy growers and magicians and other such characters um, because that's not going to allow that character to work. But if you're in a game where there's nothing that's really going to mess with the demon information or the minion information, yeah, you can leave the Kazali awake. The Kazali points to someone. Um, you confirm with the Kazali who they're pointing at, wake them up, show that person that they're the minion, and then just get them to wave at the Kazali who is sat there staring at them like, hey, you're my guy. Um, so, uh, but you don't have to. Like, you can do it the other way. A lot of people, I suspect, will um, put the Kazali back to sleep just because it makes it a bit less likely if you are in those customs or if you're ever going to run those customs that have got Poppy Girl, Mag Magician, etc. You're less likely, uh, and Lunatic as well, um, you're less likely to fall into hubris, um, ask Habby or watch the CT uh, short about it. Um, only minions that are on the script can be chosen. This is the usual rules of Clock Tower. If a character isn't on the script, it doesn't exist. Um, so they can only choose minions that are on that script. Um, and if a Kazali's made mid-game, it's set up brackets. We don't do those mid-game, so that's nice and easy. Uh, it has got a few jinxes. Um, oh, I should mention, can't be drunk poisoned. Uh, the Kazali's right up the top of the night order. Uh, it is, I think, immediately after Philosopher. I, I, I moved it for this, so don't quote me on that. Um, but it's right at the top of the night order. There's nothing that can make the Kazali drunk or poisoned at the moment um, that you're aware of. Uh, so their minion choices won't get prevented. However, uh, speaking of funny drunk poison situations, um, we all know what the first thing I'm going to bring up when we're talking about weird drunk poison situations is, right? It's the goon! Um, so we had to jinx the goon because the problem is if the Kazali chooses the goon first uh, of the minions uh, that they're trying to pick, the Kazali is drunk, they pick no more minions, the Kazali has a very lonely game with no friends, and that's not fun. Uh, however, um, you know, it's got to be in the spirit of the goon that something's got to happen. So if the Kazali chooses the goon to become a minion, remaining minion choices are decided by the storyteller. So if you're a Kazali on a goon script, uh, don't just assume that all your minions 
that you picked are actually your minions because one of them might be the goon and everything you chose after that point may not be a minion anymore and the storyteller might have picked some other people to be your minions now so you know think fast um that's number one what else we got we've got the bounty hunter uh, it's also jinxed. Uh, an evil townsfolk is only created if the bounty hunter is still in play after the Kazali acts. There's a weird dichotomy with the Kazali because it acts in setup, but its its impact is in setup, but you have to wake them up in the first night because you can't wake the Kazali up before the game starts in order to get the minion choices. Um, so basically what we're saying is that the, the setup brackets of the Kazali happens before everything else. Um, and so if you've got a bounty hunter, they won't turn the townsfolk evil. Um, choir boy. Uh, the Kazali can't choose the king to become a minion if the choir boy is in play, because otherwise you've just got a choir boy with no king. That's not a fun game for the choir boy. Um, it's also not not particularly fun for the evil team because they just it just removes two entire towns I believe from having any impact on them. Uh, Huntsman, if the Kazali chooses the damsel to become a minion and a huntsman is in play, a good player becomes the damsel. Yes, that good player that is now the damsel has got on a bluff, but. There's still a damsel in play, and there is a minion who has some ability to eliminate options as to who might be the damsel. I think that's all the jinxes. I'm just scrolling through the list. Bear with me. Um, that is all the jinxes. Um, some meta points about this demon. Uh, I've talked for a long time. Deal with it. Um, you should be used to this. You watch me play Glock Tower frequently. Um, uh, some meta choices about this demon. Uh, someone at the door, Ed. <laughs> is it this, is yeah, it this game knocking at the door? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, some meta choices about this demon. Uh, it's very easy to, for players to make this games with a Kazalian toxic if they choose to be. Um, if someone if someone is going down the line of, oh, obviously it's optimal to pick these players so we could just kill these players immediately no matter what, even if we don't know it's a Xali game yet, or is going that, oh, we think this person is evil, um, obviously these two people are best friends, or to use an example in this game, Mal and Rez always talk to each other, so why would, you know, obviously they're going to choose each other a lot of the time. You can have really toxic um, interactions based on that, be nice, don't. Um, you know, if you know your group well enough that you know exactly who someone should pick, you should also know them well enough to know that they probably won't per pick the people they should pick because you know who they should pick. So uh, be wary of that. It is, it's just a, a social choice that people can choose to make and I'm sure there will be games people have which won't be fun because of that. But I've warned you up top, so hopefully um, people will be aware of that. And both when you're making your Kazali choices, it is very tempting to pull together your ideal clique it can be unfun for you as well as your, your ideal clique and for everyone else. So be wary of that. Anything else to add, Ben? There we go. I've unmuted. Uh, no, no, I think you covered everything. Uh, I am keen to get going. Uh, I was very, very tempted to not put the Kazali in the bag for this one because sometimes I'm going to have to do that so that it's possible that I'll do it uh, so that people can't meta that I'll never do it. Uh, but I think if I didn't do it, you would all kill me. So uh, I'm going to put the Kazali in the bag. Uh, that means we have no minions. Uh, do you know what? I'm just going to shuffle these and see what we get. Unk, Town Cryer, Flower Girl, Seamstress, Amnesiac, High Priestess, Steward. Uh, we need two of those to be outsiders. Uh, the game has given us Barber and Politician, so I'll roll with that. Putting all four outsiders? No. <laughs> Let's not. Uh, but which of these do I want to take out? Uh, I'm going to take out the flower girl, and I'm going to take out the high priestess. Oh, hang on, but I, no, I don't, because because we've got a Kazali. See, even I'm fucking this up. I'm still I'm still missing characters, like, like an idiot. Uh, Undertaker, Slayer, there we go. No, let's not put the Slayer in. Uh, let's have a... Let's have a farmer. So, now that... Here's how I usually like to do Kazali. I build it. I build the game with the number of outsiders that are supposed to be in play. Then I look at that and think, right, well, if we assume that one of those outsiders is going to go away, then what should we take out of the Townsfolk bag to balance that up? I think I'm going to remove the High Priestess and put in a Puzzle Master. I would like some Drunkening uh, to be... To be available to me and I don't want to have to force it through an amnesiac ability. I think that's probably a fairly balanced build there. Let's pass them out.
let's get Sam in here. Hello. Hello, Sam. You have drawn it. Uh, you are it. Uh, there is no lunatic on this script, so you know you're not that. So, uh, who would you like to be your minions, and what minion would you like them to be? You know, I've thought about the people. I forgot to think about the minions. Let's go with Marshall as the spy. Marshall, spy. Okay. And Ellen as the poisoner. Okay. Uh, your bluffs are... Okay, well, Marshall and Ellen are minions, obviously. Uh, your bluffs are Shuganja, Virgin, and Juggler. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, that has taken two, two outsiders out, one of which could have played for evil. Uh, so it was a good, it was good. It was a good thing that we put in that extra outsider in the bag. Uh, yes, that is a very powerful uh, combo right there. Uh, let's go break the news to Ellen. Hello. Hello, Ellen. Uh, you are the poisoner, you are evil. Okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, I, f I think you can. I think you'll agree that that is something of an upgrade for you. Yeah, I'm happy with that. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to bluff, but um, yeah, we'll, well see. You can bluff the token that you've already seen because you know it's not in play. Yeah, I'm a nice, safe politician bluff on day one. Everyone's <laughs> going to love that. Okay, well, uh, your fellow minion, although he doesn't know it yet, is Marshall. Nice. Uh, and your demon is Viva La Sam. Nice, amazing. Who would you like to poison? Oh god. Um let's poison JC. JC it is, thank you. JC could be my nice fake marionette for now. Cool. Okay. Cheers. Thank you. You try and balance a game. You try and balance a game, don't you? And on night one, the whole evil team takes out all the fucking outsiders! <laughs> That is the that's gonna be the worst the worst and fastest evil team cell phone I've ever seen. That was that was impressive. Okay, well what is cool about that is we don't actually have to decide who the puzzle drunk is right now. Uh, I'll leave I'll leave the token there for now just to remind myself I need to assign it. Uh, but um, but we, but we can worry about that later and Ed will know some useful info. Uh, we'll decide that in a moment. We'll wait till later in the night. In fact, no, let's... No, we'll wait till later in the night to inform Marshall. We'll go around the thing now. I need to come up with an amnesiac ability. Uh, I think it should be to do with being nominated. Um, I think maybe... Uh, do you know what? I'm going to think about that later. I'll worry about that later. Uh, let's go over to Jackie and see what Jackie does. Hello, Jackie. Hello. Uh, you, do you want to use your ability? Yes, I do. I would like to pick Ed and JC. Ed and JC. And you learn that, yes, they're on the same team. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, this is actually quite an interesting conundrum here. Does the spy need to see who is puzzle drunk if the puzzle master is poisoned and doesn't have an ability? Probably should, shouldn't they? I think for that reason then, I'm going to go ahead and make milk puzzle drunk. Each night, learn the characters of everyone who was on the block. Ooh, that's very powerful for an amnesiac ability. Very, very powerful. Uh, right, let's go give Ed his information. I think we'll, I think we'll let Ed know that Resnora is good because then Ed can help Resnora figure out their ability. Hello. Hey, sexy. How's it going? Yeah, good, thanks. I'm feeling very sexy, uh, and I would like to sexily inform you that uh, Resnora is a good player. Great. Thanks, man. Thank you. Okay, now, Marshall. 
Each night, if someone was executed, learn the alignment of the player who nominated them. Oh, that's good. We're, we're having that. We're having that. Uh, okay. Each night. Learn the alignment. Player. Oh, I'm, I'm winning this poorly. How did you word it? Each night, if someone was executed, become the alignment of the player who nominated them. Ooh, that is good. That's that's very good. I like that. Yeah, okay. Love that. I'm, I didn't see that on my first read through. Each night, if someone was executed, become the alignment of the player who nominated them. Brilliant. Love everything about it. Um... That's basically a, a, a spicy occult leader. Okay, cool. Uh, we don't need to wake Reznora then, uh, so we go straight over to Marshall. Hello, Marshall. Hear me? Sorry, I was muted. Okay, Marshall. Uh, you are the spy, you are evil. <laughs> okay, I walked right into that. Uh, I'm sending you the Grim now. Uh, Ellen is your minion. Viva La Sam is your demon. Okay. Let me just take a good look here. Um, Master Undertaker. Oh, you can peruse that over the course of the evening. So, uh, yep. okay. Off your, off your pop. Thank you. Thank you. I think, actually, though, that's our last trip tonight, isn't it? That's the last person we visit. No one else after that. Okay, cool. Hello. Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's a beautiful, sunny day, uh, except for the, the stench of my corpse, although that doesn't make it less sunny, which I suppose is a silver lining. Good luck, everyone. Uh, the game's begun. Definitely a Kazali in play. Definitely an organ grinder. Just assume there is. Uh, good luck. Right. Oh boy. Where to begin? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Aggie. Um, yeah, well, it, well, I'll tell you this, JC. If I was the Kazali out of picture, I already I... had my picks lined up. <laughs> Nice. I wouldn't have picked you because it would have felt too obvious. But. Yeah, that's yeah, that's fair. Um, no, I I mean I literally wrote the cast list for this and um, chose my my Kazali picks oh. at the same time. <laughs> so, oh, I appreciate that. Yeah, it's like why would I not? Um, yeah. So what, what level of information do you want to do, darling? Um, oh, silly questions. Those those are always fun. Great. Um, have you got one to mind? Or should I come up with something nonsense? Uh, Oh, let's brace to come up with nonsense. That sounds fun. Okay. Um, if your character icon was the... Hello. Hello, Resnora. Um, does my ability have anything to do with voting? Uh, I would say you are... You're not warm, but you're not cold either. You're kind of uh, room Luke temp. Warm. Luke warm. Room temp. I suppose, yeah. Right. Okay. Cool, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I figured, you know, voting is inherently linked to nominating, uh, so... Seems like a reasonable response. Let's check in with the baddies. Uh, it was at 9 o'clock. Yeah. Flower Girls Malachan? Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah, good shouts. Um, I will keep an eye on things and decide whether to poison, etc. Cool. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Cool. An Aggie. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Cool. Well, sounds like good. It. Sounds good to me too. I am. Yeah. I'm really Rosnora. At least I think Very I am. well. <laughs> I can't remember if I am or not. Ah, but did you start out as Resnora or did you change into Resnora? That's the question. I believe I started as Resnora. Very well. I I accept your I accept your problem. What's uh, yeah. uh, what's what are, going on? What do you feel like? I'll just hard claim I'm the amnesiac. I have no idea what my ability is. Superb. Okay, you're the amnesiac. I 
am the town crier, and I'm going to play town crier my favorite way, which is, I don't care who nominates, I don't care who votes, I'm vaguely going to pay attention to that stuff, but honestly, I'm not going to write anything down, so I'm going to do my best to try to remember it all. All right, that's fair. Yeah. Um, full disclosure, today I asked if my ability has anything to do with voting, and I got lukewarm. Ooh, okay, that's interesting. So... so what should we go with? Um, if you were playing a game with Patters yeah. and it gets to the final three and Patters came out with your claim, having never claimed it to date, what are the odds of you believing him? 70%. Okay. As a, as a pull out of the arse late claim. Okay, that makes sense. Cool. Uh, yeah, what would you like to know? Let's see, um, if you had to hide this as a wrapped Christmas present uh, from your child before Christmas, how mm -hmm. likely is it they would find it before you could put it under the tree? The item on your top. Oh, oh, almost non-existent. It, but that's they'd, slightly they'd biased. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, I, well, I think they'd, they'd find it under the tree, um, no. but, but not before that. Uh, but that's also because I'm a devious bastard and I'm good at hiding things. So. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right. Cool. Cool. Just some. <laughs> well, gonna mark you down as not the Shigenja. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've never played an organ organ grinder game yet. A random. Just never uh, played in one. <laughs> <laughs> you tried to. You were told to talk to. Um, I think so. Actually. Who you told to talk to? Uh, I'm not going to say for now. Mm. You might be evil. Should protect me instead. No, I think you might be evil. Well, that's good to know. That. Okay. Uh, I've heard of a Shigenja pointing your way. Oh, interesting. I've also heard of Shigenja, but they didn't tell me which way they were pointing, which might be because they're pointing my way. I think they might be pointing your way. <laughs> yeah, fair <laughs> enough. Okay. Well, I'm not evil, but um, yeah, that's fine. Was it Aggie? No. Interesting. Okay. okay. See you later. Heard of different Shigenjas. Okay, cool. No, no, I just wanted to see whether you'd just say yes. All right. Um, all right, I'll put you down. Well, so for my, I, I'm going to go with Shigenja. I've been saying anti clockwise. Uh, but for a two, I would say uh, Shigenja or Slayer. Okay. Um, and I would probably say something like Juggler or High Priestess. Cool. Uh, Ellen said she was probably going to go... Uh, she was thinking about maybe going virgin. Uh, she said she would do Flower Girl and... Or she would give Flower Girl and Juggler for two for twos. She was going to do Shigenja, and I was like, well, I've already been hard claiming that, so... Um, if you and uh, Ellen can coordinate on getting Sam Poison killed, you might be able to claim Farmer and kind of coast. Uh, yeah, we might, might be able to do that. Um, Ed and I gave very unhelpful hints to each other to give us tasks to Google in the night. But if, if he's actually good, then it might be worth me being more helpful to him. More, more open with him. Yeah. But we've got a good plan. I've got a monk who's going to protect me. Um, and if I die, then we'll know that they're puzzle drunk and we can regret the fact that I can't choose it because I'm dead. Sounds good. Yeah. Hey. Cool. Cheers. Cheers, Jack. I did it! Honest with every single noise. person I've talked to. In my house, or was that was that on stream? I think we should bring these guys back anyway. Calling us back? All right. <laughs> okay, welcome back, everyone. Uh, there are twelve of you alive, uh, but we do have a juggler on this script. So, would anyone like to juggle before we put nominations? Um, um, I would like to claim Amnesiac and kill the juggler. Thank you, Sam. Cool, thanks. Okay, we'll start with Patters. Uh, I'll juggle. Aggie is the Undertaker, Ellen is the High Priestess, JC is the Puzzle Master, Sam is Shigenja, and Sam as the Monk. Cool. Where's Nora? I would like to juggle Patters as the Kazali, the Poisoner, the Harpy, the Spy, and the Organ Grinder. Where's you. Nora? You're the fucking marionette shuttle. <laughs> uh, I will juggle 
marshal through Ed as the organ grinder. Okay. Nope. Uh, I would like to juggle Jackie and Sam as the Kazali and nothing else. Okay, Marshall. <laughs> uh, Marshall will juggle, juggle Patters, Aggie, Ellen, JC, and Sam as the organ grinder. Thank you. Ellen. I juggle JC through to Milk as the Kazali. Okay, juggling's done. Any nominations? I would like to nominate Patters. Tell us why. <laughs> um, I, you know, I'll just, I'll just out to town right now. I don't care. I'm the amnesiac. I didn't wake last night. Today I asked if my ability has anything to do with voting. I got lukewarm. I'm never going to solve this, but I figured if it's kind of vaguely related to voting that it might be about nominating and patters joked about telling me that i was his marionette at some point before the game started therefore i uh need to vote uh nominate and vote on him just to you know be safe okay passes in my defense i have jokingly done it both during the night phase before the game and just a few moments ago so i've fulfilled my promise uh i've told everyone the truth so far um i think my execution would be Bad for town. Um, including Resnora? Inc- well, I've not talked to Resnora. <laughs> Privately, I've told everyone the truth. I just told no you uh, told Resnora that she's your uh, marionette powers. I also told her to shut up, and she didn't do that either, <laughs> did she? <laughs> <laughs> Getting saucy tonight. Okay. That was, well. said, that was said with love. It was said with love. <laughs> was not I love you too, Patters. <laughs> Um, Sam nominates JC. Okay, tell us why. I think they could be evil, and if they're happy to die, this is a good kill. JC? Not super happy to die yet. There is some soft mechanical information pointing towards me being good. Um... I would be happy to explore the reasons why I could be evil beyond just everyone's got to pull a token out of the bag uh, on a future day. Okay. Sure. Also, heard self mechanical information for you being evil. Ooh, gotta love that soft info. <laughs> right. Was it that? Was it that you picked him to be your marionette? Because that's totally. That, that's 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 it. Six uh, is enough. <laughs> I'm not going to nominate because there's a town crier claim, uh, but I am not a particularly good execution. I'm one half of a seamstress, yes, so unless two evils were sniped. Then... Who, would you, who would you nominate, do you think? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Hope that helps. Well, then I can't do it for you. <laughs> Game solving information right there. Yeah. Well, I'm not hearing any other nominations, so. I'll bring it to a close. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. JC is executed and dies. Everybody goes to sleep. Wow. Outsiders, no outsiders allowed in this one. Um, okay, so... Uh, Rare, JC was nominated by a good player, so according to our amnesiac ability, Resnora remains good. I'm not sure whether Resnora should remain good or learn good. Um, I don't know. I'll, I'll worry about that later on in the night. Let's find out what happens first, because it might be completely irrelevant. Hello. Hello, Ellen. Who do you want to poison? I think I'm going to go for Malishan. Malishan. Okay, Malishan it is. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, right. That's that. Next up, we've got... So we've got... Hello, Ben. Hello. Who's getting protected? It's going to be Malashan. It's going to be Malashan, but also, do you want to uh, add any... Oh, oh, have you gone? Are you still there? No, I'm here, I'm here. Yeah. Oh, you, your uh, webcam just disappeared for a second then. Well, there's a good reason for that. Oh, okay. Um, 
So, uh, for anyone who doesn't know, um, I am currently doing a run of pins uh, for a Pride Atheist token, which we're calling the Gaytheist token, uh, which will raise money for a charity called Stonewall, which is a UK charity for LGBTQ plus people uh, in the UK and all around the world. It looks a little bit like this. Uh, this is an artist's uh, drawing so far, uh, so it's not it's not actually printed, uh, but they cost £10 each, uh, and all the proceeds will go to, to that charity directly. So if you're interested, go to shop.patters.live. That's all. Malachon, never die! Goodbye! Yeah. Hey, <laughs> shop.patters.live. There's your link, people. Uh, yeah, if that's something you're interested in grabbing, uh, go grab one. Uh, on with the game. Let's find out who dies. Hello. Hello. Who do you want to kill? I'm not sure if Jackie's used her ability yet, but I think I will go with Jackie. Okay. It is. All right. Thank you. It is. Okay. Uh, I think we'll we'll go with. Uh... What was execute? Learn the alignment. Because I think Fresnor is never going to get it if we don't. That's the great thing about um, Amnesiac Ability. Edit them on the fly. Uh, okay, we're going to go and tell Resnora good. Hello. Hello, Resnora. You learn good. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Five Sam, who is the farmer, but has not died, so that's not relevant. Uh, six is Aggie the Undertaker, who's going to correctly learn uh, that JC the puzzle. Aggie is not picking. Okay, well, I guess we'll come to Aggie later then. Uh, so, Malashan now. Flower Girl uh, is going to learn if a demon voted today. And the answer to that is yes, but they're poisoned, so they're going to learn a no. Hello. Hello. Uh, you learn a no. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, okay, now Milk, who is puzzle drunk, is going to learn if a minion nominated today. Now, nominators were Resnor and Sam, neither of whom are minions, so Milk will learn a yes. That is really real. Oh, I survived! Hello! You did indeed survive, uh, and you learn that a... You learn uh, a no. A minion did not nominate today. No, a minion did not nominate. Okay, cool, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, yes, you're right, the Puzzle Master is dead, but their ability specifies even if you die. Uh, okay. Fucking you hell, know, this has been a long night. Uh, Jackie's dead, so she doesn't wake, but she wouldn't have waked anyway. Uh, so we send Marshall Grimoire. Brilliant. Uh, we then remove that from there. Give a yes to milk. Or should I give a yes to milk? Oh, okay. You learn if I mean oh crap. Oh do you know what? It doesn't matter. We'll give him we'll give him one night of legit info. It 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 would be too metrable if I went back and changed it now. Uh that's fine. A happy little accident, as Bob Ross would say. Yeah, I think I think actually giving him false info on on that would have been a bit suspect anyway. Good morning, Ravenswood Bluff. Jackie died in the night. No. Oh, hang on a Is that second. reassuring for you, Milk? Sec. Two seconds. Bold, <laughs> bold Kazali play. Yes. I thought you might have forgotten about me. Well, you didn't pick up in my three attempts to call you, so I moved on it and then didn't forgot. Call. <laughs> it didn't call. Either way, uh, you it's learn thing. that JC was the puzzle master. Oh, thanks, man. Sorry You're about welcome. not picking up. It's, it's all right. It's not pig. Don't worry about it. 
or Marshall, respectively, their uh, their marionettes. <laughs> 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 We've had that conversation in the night. It's like they're no longer paranoid. <laughs> Alright, Ben, we good? We are good. Jackie died in the night. Also, for Yay! anyone who wants to know, the Kazali is on the script uh, all that. Hello. Muted. Thank you. Is my ability each night asterisk you learn the alignment of the player you nominated? You are warm. Okay. Cool. Thank you. If you found a typo on the wiki entry, send it to Ed. I'm sure we'll be delighted. I don't know. What would you like to do? Um, go for like a two or something. Okay, well, you got juggled as a high priestess yesterday. What was that about? I will give that as one of my two. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, so I'm either the high priestess or the slayer. Okay. Um, I I did the undertaker or the farmer. Cool. Have you heard what about what JC might have been? Um, no, I'm not sure to be honest. I haven't spoken to JC yet. Okay, cool. And if you're the high priestess, who did you get pointed at yesterday? Uh, I'm not gonna say for now. I, if I'm the high priestess, have confirmed that with that person. Oh, okay, fair enough. Oh. That's it then. Thank you. Excellent. Out. Yeah, I'm curious of what people might have. But, um, yeah. But, yeah. I've got nothing. Um, last night I was woken and I learned good. Today I asked if my ability is each night you learn the alignment of the player you nominated. I got warm. Hmm. Okay. Well. So, you know, I might get yeah. there. I might not. I don't. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be particularly helpful to town. Uh, so, yeah, you know. Well, no, oh, well. such is the life of the amnesiac, I guess. <laughs> That's probably a good sign. Um, I will tell you, I'm either the high priestess or the slayer. Oh, okay. She isn't. I'll tell you that was a lie, actually. Um, <laughs> is, is there much? Oh, there's a vigor mortis. I'm just like, is there much reason for evil to die in the night? But I think there's enough that I'm going to not be. I'll give you an actual two. Um, but not narrow it down too much. Okay. Um, I am the steward or the virgin. If you were the virgin, I was looking for you yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> cool. All right. Um, yeah, I, I haven't been like super subtle about it. I've never been in Shugenja before uh, yeah. that, that I can think of, anyway. But uh, I. I think Ellen's a good kill. I've, there's also Flower Girl information that makes Ellen a candidate out there. Mm. Resnora seemed like, uh, which I don't know, maybe she's been talking to you, but <laughs> also thought that Ellen might be a good kill. So. Yeah, a lot of people think it's, which probably means Ellen's good, but. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's how, uh, how it often goes. Um, okay. All right, well, sounds good. Um, I'll tell you, Paz and other Sam are in a double claim, but. They're both people who lie all the time, so I'm not too worried oh, yeah, about yeah. it right now. <laughs> I guess you tell me what you were, did you? Oh, I'm... I'm either the flower girl or the farmer. Bluffing flower girl. But there is a real flower girl out there. Flower. Sounds good. Uh, Alright, cool. All right. There's a good chance I'm poisoned, because I've claimed to the double claim, and I think one of them might be the poisoner. <laughs> oh, yeah. But, yeah, who knows. Alrighty. Cool, thanks a lot. Right, thanks. Smash the fire. Put one down because I have a claim of the other somewhere, and then I'm just going to write or the other one. Sick. All right, cool. Thank you. As we both know. As we, as we both know. As we both know, the Shigenja is very know. close to you. The Shigenja, yeah. And that Shigenja is, of course. In the game, yeah. It, it is, in fact, in yeah, the game. Yeah. You're right. That's true. And if, if the Shigenja had a name that started with a letter, that letter would be? Um, in the alphabet. Which half of the alphabet, Ellen? Uh, the best half. No, the worst <laughs> half. The worst Wait, half. Which, which is the worst half? The worst half. 
Uh, I'm dead center, so I'm I'm never pushing Genja. I think P's quite central. It's, it's quite central. I think M is dead center, right? Is it? So like L and then, yeah. I think. Anyway, we should yeah. execute you today. <laughs> it's time for you to dial. It's not right. Oh no, I wanted to talk to you. Sorry. <laughs> okay, we can talk tomorrow. <clears throat> Welcome back all. Uh, there are now ten of you alive. Uh, would anyone like to nominate anybody else? Or themselves? JC, I have an honest question for you, JC. Yes. Were you evil? No. I was right. stupid. I told you the truth and then was okay. stupid, if that helps. That's fine. I'll nominate Ellen. Okay. Patters, tell us why you've nominated Ellen. I've heard of Shigenja information that points at Ellen. I've heard of Flower Girl information that points at Ellen. They can't both be lying. What would that be? Two liars? <laughs> Kill me. I'm the virgin. So... <laughs> no. I'm... Patches has been pushing for me so hard. I'm like, is he going to do it? He did it. Um, but yeah, kill me. That's fine. And then kill Patches tomorrow. Okay. Looking for five. Ouch. I will never die. <laughs> That's that's a rough Kazali pick if I've ever seen one. The Virgin? Yeah. Mm. You kind of lose that in the bluff. Sadly, not a Kazali pick. Seven is enough. Ellen about to die with seven votes. Are you not the Kazali pick because you are the Kazali? <laughs> like I mean, if so, you're going to find out pick. very soon. <laughs> I'd like to thank you all for making that very simple for me. I can simply copy across my notes from yesterday's Flower Girl and add my own name to it. <laughs> Just in case there's a town crier, uh, I'm going to nominate uh, Mark. Milk nominates... Who was that? Sorry, Marshall. Marshall. Yeah, let's go for it. Okay, tell us why. This is just for Town Crier information. I'm being a good teammate. Uh, we shouldn't vote up Marshall. Marshall's probably good. Marshall? Uh, that was the perfect accusation. I agree with everything Milk just said. Okay, eight to B. So, if Ellen is the virgin, I am the Super marionette, in trouble? or Ellen is the or puzzle master. Not enough. I don't um, know. I could be an outsider. Marshall nominates Patters. Marshall, tell us why you have nominated Patters. Uh, Patters just said he could be the marionette. It's possible. Patters, are you the marionette? I also said I couldn't die, so... Okay. That seems like a challenge. I'll be the eighth. Patters, are you the marionette? you got to tell me if you're the marionette. I, I, I wouldn't know, I guess, would be my argument. Are you a cop, Patters? <laughs> it's entrapment if I don't tell you. <laughs> Five's not enough. Any other nominations? Following it then, in five. That is everyone. Well Four. done. Three. Two. One. Ellen is executed and dies, but he goes to sleep. Okay, uh, that is rough for the bad guys. Uh, very rough. That's all the information control out of the way now, except for arguably maybe the spy. Uh, either way, let's go see what... Pa Hi. Hello. Um, Who are you protecting? Oh, break the rules and let me pick myself. Um, let's go with Malachan. Sure, why not? Malachan it is, thank you. Okay, uh, this is going to be important. Uh, Sam's got several choices of useful info to take out of the game, including um, a flower girl, an amnesiac, a monk who's protecting, and an undertaker. Hello. Hello. I should probably pick Aggie, so I will pick Aggie. Okay, Aggie it is. Thank you. Best possible choice, in my opinion. Uh, although, to be fair, Aggie seeing that Ellen was the poisoner would have, I think, validated Sam's 
fake Shugenja info, so I, I don't know. Uh, right. Amnesiac now uh, is going to learn a good. Hello. Hello. You learn good. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Leave that there. Yeah. Okay. Um. Uh, it's not dead. Vega is dead. Flower Girl. I, Flower Girl and Sam Cry. I always get these two mixed up. Um, each night you learn if a demon voted today. Did a demon vote today? Yes. You learn a lady. Okay. Hello. Hello. Yes, a demon voted today. I'm so shocked by that. Thank you. <laughs> <You're> <laughs> Bye. Okay, now Town Crier. Each night you learn if a minion nominated today. Did a minion nominate today? Patters Milk Marshall. Patters Milk Marshall. Uh, oh, okay. That's the spy. Ooh, okay. I'm just going to go ahead and say no. Because I think that is the least useful bit of information we can give Milk in the circumstance. We could back up the Virgin, couldn't we? We say yes. That makes Patters look shady. Oh, yeah, I think we're going to have to say yes, despite everything I've just said. Hello, Milk. Yes. A minion Ooh. nominated today. Scary. Okay, thanks. Bye. You're welcome. <clears throat> okay. We've, I've made the call. Uh, that's how it's going. Now we just give uh, Marshall some grimoire action. Uh, thing. Like. Grimoire. Okay. Hmm. I'm drinking a uh, Glen Canick Brewery Christmas Spiced Red Ale here. It's got a little Santa on it, look. Uh, it's got cinnamon and orange peel in it. But it's a bit weird, to be honest. A pleasant weird, though. Uh, okay, let's wake these guys up. Good morning, everybody. I'm afraid Aggie did not survive the night. So this Shigenja information is not looking great for me anymore. <laughs> Hello. Um, is I want to get my notes up. Is my ability each night each night asterisk you learn the alignment of the player executed that day? You are very warm. Cool. Thank you very much. You're gonna get it, guys. It's gonna happen. Paris uh, told me that he's a Kazal. <laughs> well, I can like, believe that. No! Sam is the monk and he's protecting me! Okay. Well, I, I can believe that. <laughs> um, what well, did you learn about JC? I'm very curious. I learned that JC was the puzzle master, which I find hard to believe because I don't think that he would use it like straight away, but he also didn't run to the storyteller when he was on the block. JC didn't use it, he forgot about it. He forgot about it! Yeah. This is the second thing that JC forgot today. <laughs> <laughs> oh, quite plausible. Um, yeah, for what it's worth, and the farmer, probably not going to die, because I think Pat is evil and he knows. Um, mm. Also, yeah. I'm honestly, given how this game has unfolded so far, I wouldn't be surprised if it's a spy game. Mm. Yeah, that's, that's fair. Uh... But wait, Jackie was a spent character, so why would she, she be killed? I don't, oh. I don't have a clamp, for Jackie. <laughs> That's what Milk told me. Oh, I, I so yeah, three or five, either way is fine. Um, Jace, yeah. Oh, yeah. I've told JC and Patters both that I am the barber. Everybody else, I'm kind of saying juggler or outsider. Okay, sounds good. All right. Well, uh, all right, cool. Thanks. Thank you. JC, I haven't talked to JC. Ed claimed to me, claimed Stuart who saw me. Okay. 
I don't know if Ed's claiming that to anybody else or what Ed is telling anybody else. That's just what Ed told me. Um, I got woken up after we executed JC and I learned good. Um, and then I got woken up after we executed Ellen and also learned good. I'm kind of stalled out though, because today I asked, is my ability each night, asterisk, you learned the alignment of the player executed that day and I got very warm. Alignment of the player who nominated the executee? I don't know how to say that word. Maybe along that line? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably try that for tomorrow. Okay. Um, yeah, who was the other one yesterday? Was it Patters? Uh, it was Patters and Marshall. Me, Patters and Marshall. Right. I would believe either Patters or Marshall is evil, to be fair. Yeah, me too. Uh, um, well, it's I me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I turned around. Yeah, hmm, interesting. Um, do you know what Patters is claiming? Nope. And he wouldn't tell hmm. me once I told him he was in a doubt crier, yes, so. Nice. Okay. Um, there's a, there's I at least three monks running around, so I think, you know, there's shenanigans. Yeah, yeah. Um, I could certainly cool. be poisoned. I've been completely open about my, about my claim, so. Fair enough. Probably. Um, poisoner, like, cool. Makes sense. I will tell you that I'm the steward, but I've not. I've told two people who my ping was. Exciting. Well, don't uh, tell me. Uh, I can be evil. Yeah, exactly. Um, it's, uh, and the thing is, I'm inclined to believe that if we're in a Kazali game, the Kazali's less likely to have chosen Mario. But we've not got an organ grinder. We've not heard anything about Harpy, which is feeling quite poisonous by. What did you do? Uh, I forgot to get a consultation when I was on the block. Because I, in my head, I was going to make it in like a day or so. <laughs> And then I forgot, oh wait, just because I'm getting executed and that plans out the window, that doesn't mean I can't still go for a consult. So, you know, Premier League of Clock Tower and all that. <laughs> Premier League. Well, your powers is still, like, drunking someone, so... Yeah, so I've still had an impact, so that's all good. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's no impact, though. Yeah, you've had quite uh, a big yeah, impact um, these yep. last two games, haven't you, JC? Yeah, really yeah, quite I've... impactful evening for you. Yeah, yeah, I've been on a real blind of the last 90 minutes or so. <laughs> yeah, we need to give you some forgetfulness pills. I think they're sleep, is what the pills are, but we'll get to that when we get to that. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Well, it's, uh, you know, it's our decision to stay up at silly hours and reveal yeah. characters and stream. Premier League of Clock Tower <laughs> and whatnot. Yeah, I'm the Undertaker who... Okay. Right. You're not. I'm not the demon. I am just the amnesiac. I've gotten to very warm. Ooh. Okay. So Eve, very, very warm. I get woken each night, but not the first night. Um, and both nights I that I was woken, I learned good. Uh, so today I asked each night is my ability. Each night you learn the alignment of the player executed that day, and I got very warm. Cool. So tomorrow I'm gonna ask is my ability each night you learn the alignment of the player who nominated the player executed that day. Okay. That's the logical next step. Uh, either way though, I'm starting to think that kind of this all signs are pointing to you being good. So. Oh, that is not what other people think, but this is good news. I'm all for um, it. Um, well, you nominated JC, didn't you? Yeah. And you no. nominate? You didn't. I nominated Ellen. Okay, you nominated Ellen. Who nominated JC? Uh, Sam. Okay. Well, you nominated you, Ellen. You nominated me, Sam nominated JC, I, then that day ended. Then I nominated Ellen, and then the day ended. Yeah. No, then Milk nominated somebody. Marshall nominated me. Yeah. yeah. I think if my ability is not... If my ability is what I'm currently thinking it is then that would suggest that you're good. Woo! I'm big excited. Tell everyone this, and it won't look suspicious coming from my neighbor. Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> Very sus. <laughs> All right. I'm going to make a big play today and see whether it pays off. Okay, welcome back everyone. I'm being told that my subscriber sting is annoying, so I'm gonna... Oh, oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. <laughs> that should be locked. That should be locked where it is. Gonna gonna move those follows uh, all the way up 
There we are. That's annoying. Okay, right. Welcome back, everyone. Nominations are open. I would like to nominate Resnora. Okay, Patters nominates Resnora. Tell us why. If I'm a minion, I don't know it, which means that Resnora must be the demon. So, let's, let's kill the demon. Resnora? I, I would think that most of you would know me well enough to know that as a demon, I would not bluff something like Amnesiac. Uh, I am very frustrated by my very slow lack of progress on figuring out what this ability is, and I'm fairly confident I'm going to die before I figure it out, which is going to frustrate me even more. Um, I'm not the demon. I honestly, oddly think Patters might be good, and it weirds me out saying that. It makes me feel a little icky inside. Um, so please don't kill me, and also maybe let's not kill Patters today either. All right. Four required. Consider this hand up a thumbs up. Um, JC, I'll hard. share them with you tomorrow. <laughs> I have a weird feeling that Patters is good because I know he's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that everyone else has this feeling that Patters is good because that is obviously not the feeling that I have. <laughs> uh, there you go, Patters. It's working on someone. Uh, Ed nominates um, Marshall. Ed nominates Marshall. Tell us why, Ed. I heard a town cry yes yesterday, uh, from yesterday. Uh, the people who nominated yesterday, Patters, Milk, Marshall. Uh, I just interrogated Milk for about two thirds of today. Um, and I'm inclined to give Milk the benefit of the doubt, which leaves Patters and Marshall. I think Patters is probably good based on my interaction and something else that happened uh, earlier today. And so Marshall leaves a minion candidate. Marshall? Uh, better now than later. If you want to kill me, go ahead. Okay, four required. There's also no evidence I'm a minion. Well, I've done nominate a virgin, they didn't die. What? I'm just gonna, this whole game, I'm gonna be frustrated <laughs> if we don't get that. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I'm getting away with it. Six is enough, Marshall about Sam. to die. Sam, why did you vote on that, given, you know... Um, uh, I'm worried about oh, that. Sorry, people. Viva Sam. Sorry. sorry, sorry. I should have specified. There, that. That's my bad. There, there is a possibility it popped in my head. For example, like a spy or something. Okay, I could see that. I think it's unlikely you're top six, so calling it in five. Oh. I do think we have a politician in play for its worth. One. Agree. Marshall's yeah. executed and dies. One goes to sleep. Well, 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 it's looking, it's not looking good for the Kazali, uh, but it is a great showcase of the Kazali, uh, specifically um, how badly it can screw itself by getting rid of all, all the outsiders. And also, if you're a Kazali and Ed's in the game, just pick Ed uh, to be one of your minions, otherwise you're going to have a rough time. Uh, right, let's get Patters in here. Hello. Hello, Patters. Who would you like to protect? Like a broken record, let's keep our mouth on. Okay, mouth it is. Thank you. Okay, killing time. Hello. Well, that was probably less than ideal, but I needed uh, <laughs> I, I needed to vote for Flower Girl. I feel like, and uh, yeah, uh, that was suspicious. Anyway. Let's kill. I know he's puzzle drunk, but I'm pretty sure Melishan is still being protected, probably. But I don't know if I want to kill Petters yet. So let's kill Milk. Okay, Milk it is. Thank you. Right, thank you. That's rough. Uh, Sam seems to think Malishan is puzzle drunk. Uh, <laughs> and so he's killed the actual puzzle drunk person. Uh, I don't think this could have gone worse for Evil. I think almost every single thing that has happened uh, has been not good for them. But, and I think we're about to see the beauty of this game now, that does not mean that the Evil team are out of it. Because that can change. Uh, all we have to do from now on is help them in any way we can. I'm not sure what ways they'll be. 
but uh, but we'll certainly explore them. Okay, Resnora learns a good. Hello. Hello, Resnora. You learn good. Excellent. Thank you so much. <clears throat> okay, uh, Malashan. You learn if a demon voted today, and a demon did vote today. Hello. Oh. Uh, yes, a demon voted today. Hey, well, clear as one person. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Bye. Okay. Uh, I think that's everything. Yeah. Well. Okay. Cool. Let's wake these guys up. Good morning, everybody. I'm afraid milk has sipped his last <laughs> carton. <laughs> I appreciate the demon. Just gonna get this out of the way. Okay. Uh, is my ability each night asterisk? You learn the alignment of the player who nominated the player that was executed that day. Bingo! That is correct. Each night, if someone was executed today, you learn the alignment of the player who nominated them. Oh, excellent! Cool, awesome! Thank yep. you so much. You're welcome. Wow, that is so powerful. <laughs> I think I. I, it, is in, it is in God's hands now because I don't think we have any tools in our toolbox to help the evil team at this point. Um, turn around. Patters is good. Um, okay. okay. <laughs> my and my bingo is um, each is roughly uh, each night you learn the alignment of the player who nominated the player that was executed that day. Okay, so wow. you also know I'm good, but that didn't help you. Um, well, yeah, I kind you had of reason to believe that anyway. Yeah. yeah. So. Uh, just for reference, JC, uh, I got Res as my ping. Ooh, okay. So, yeah. JC, Ooh. who nominated you? Uh, Patters, I think. No. No, it was Patters. Who did nominate me? Yeah, it was Patters on the basis of information that was pinging you, wasn't it? <laughs> no, it was uh, Marshall. I heard it was Sam, but I'm not sure which Sam. Maybe it was Sam. Um, we should ask Milk. I think. Cool. And Ed was already cleared by my day two, so. Yeah. My, my two, so. Yeah. Like, basically, I've got no useful information apart from that apart night from two info. Probably one of the Sams. Yeah, which tells me, yeah, basically, it was. I'd already narrowed it down to Sam or Milk, and Milk died in the night, so. If That's... it was good info. Like, the only living player in my yes is Sam. Um, cool. And um, if not, I just think it kind of has to be awesome. So. The only worrying thing is as well if there was a barber swap. Yeah, with a barber swap, like all, like who knows? Like all things anywhere. are off. Uh, um, but it could be padders actually. Like I think we've killed one yeah. evil. So um, in either we, case, if they moved it, it was probably to padders. <laughs> yeah, um, I'd still really like to kill padders, but I'm also happy to go with a uh, Sam. Yeah, so I think padders is decent. Good shouts. I think. Especially yeah. if we try and control the voting a little bit, because if I survive another night, and yes. I think Padders is the poisoner, so... Yeah. Cool. Cool. Thanks a lot. Thank you. <laughs> if anything, to keep me alive would be to annoy Ellen, and that's a win in my... Potion! What are you? You are a hole in my grip. Uh, flower girl. Oh, you're the flower girl. Okay. Have you found the demon yet? Yes, but... Um, yeah. If well, I was not poison knight two, if I was not poison knight two, it's exactly Sam, not Vivo or Sam, other Sam. Mm. Um, okay. But I have a strong suspicion that I was poisoned. Mm, fair enough. I mean, um, Milk and I were just discussing that Sam probably needs to go. Uh, but also, if the demon used the barber swap last night, then we're probably just yeah. not getting I... not getting far at all. Yeah. So I think. I think I was likely poisoned and Patters is the starting poisoner. It could be the demon now. I would like Patters dead as well. So, and if they did use a barber swap, they could have moved it to Patters, thinking we're just going to leave him alone as a minion. Yeah, Patters keep, can't keep getting away with this, as Chat always yeah. says. I'd kind of like to kill Patters, because I think either we get the demon or we get rid of the poisoner. And I can get uh, one night of good info. <laughs> well, I would encourage you to just nominate Patters and vote. Yep. Sounds good. Alright, good luck with that! Bye! Thanks. Oh, sorry, Malash and I was the Undertaker, in case you didn't know. 
Oh, Marshall, cool. you're muted. Did you confirm anyone? I forget you got when you died. Uh, I did, yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, welcome back, everyone. Uh, we now have six of you alive. Nominations are open. Mal or Shadow nominate Patters. Okay, tell us why, Mal. Uh, didn't fuck a virgin. Probably starting Poisoner if evil, and there could have been a Barber swap, so I think we. This is good in a lot of worlds. Answers. I never have and never will be evil. Also, I can't die. Ben, those are the rules of the game, right? <laughs> can confirm those are the rules of the game. Uh, well, don't vote then. We are playing the Patters are... can't die or be evil. Quite similar to Blood on the Clock Tower, uh, superficially. Uh, three is the number required. I also, don't want to use the dead mode. Mad at oh, I'm fine. I just, I, I'm, it, it's actually it's fine if I die. I'm, I'm the monk who's only been protected Malachon. Like, if I die, it's whatever. It's Sam, really fine. Ed, no, 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 it's fine. I'll be the last vote. I'll be the last vote. It's Nora! <laughs> 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 Pat is gonna make me cry this Two game. I just want Patters to die. Res Resnora nominates Viva La Sam. Okay, tell us why. Um, I I don't know whether or not Viva La Sam is good. Um, but I do know that if if Viva La Sam is good, um, he's no longer helpful to town in terms of his ability. His brain will always be helpful to town. Um, and this would also help me prolongingly test a theory, so. Okay, Sam? I really do think we should have gone for Patters with the other side of the um, the Virgin stuff. Uh, I don't know what went on there, but um, I'm a good player. Uh, I've been uh, trying to mostly kill people on my anti-clockwise side. I think my, besides Patters, Kind of taking a blind shot in the dark, I'd probably go for Malachon, but I really don't know. Okay, three minimum. Uh, Malachon, we should make this a left versus right side issue. In that case, Viva yeah. is one of two potential demon candidates left. Yeah. If, um, if we, I was about to say, if we don't get you on the block, Viva, I'd love you to nominate Mal, but I, never mind. Or is it <laughs> off? Any other nominations? Um. In oh. case you met Jesse because of the Shugenja, that made sense. Yeah, 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 I understand. So I have what? One more, uh, I have one more uh, execution after this? Yeah. If Evil Assam's information is good, though, then... Well, actually, no, maybe not. Tied, Hatters, I want you to know, I believe in you. I don't, <laughs> Hatters. <laughs> I'm not going to change my plan that I've done for the rest of the game. I'm telling you now as the monk... I'm going to protect Malachan. Cool, Demon, man. feel free to sink. I, I don't care. I, I'm, I'll nominate Malachan. Okay, tell us why. Um, I suspect this is a better kill. Um, like I said, I feel like we should have gone after Patters. Uh, but yeah, we only got two executions left, and I don't really like being sacrificed uh, so late in the game. So, uh, yeah. Malachan? Uh... I have got no inf good information since night two, so if you want to clear me, I'd rather you do it now than in final three. Okay, five to die, four to tie. And we're not getting this. Malachon, if you actually are the demon, I appreciate you not picking me to be one of your minions. <laughs> Therefore, if you are the demon, you will be sleeping in the guest room tonight. <laughs> Okay, uh, not enough. Evil Sam about to die. Pulling it in five, four, three, two, one. Sam is executed and dies. And the game is over. The good team has won what yes. has to be one of the roughest <laughs> games I've ever seen for Evil Team. <laughs> oh. so, up until so I've run the Kazali Lake seven or eight times, and every other time it has fucking demolished the good team. <laughs> Uh, and there's people in chat now going, oh, this Kazali looks a bit shit. It's like, honestly, trust me, this is not at all. The, the it's, it's, it's the other way around. <laughs> um, but uh, what happened this game was every single bad thing that could have happened for the evil team happened. Uh, so shall we begin with Viva La Sam, our starting Kazali. 
Uh, I put an extra outsider in the bag for this game. Uh, <laughs> then Sam took two of them out. Immediately. Oh, oh no. One of them was Ellen, the starting barber, who became poisoner. No, sorry, oh. Ellen, the starting... Uh, politician who became poisoner. Oh. Could have had an extra oh. evil. Uh, the other was Marshall, the starting barber who became spy. Um, JC was our puzzle master who uh, never asked me a question. Um, Didn't need to. Was executed on day one. Uh, <laughs> the puzzle drunk was Milk, the town crier, who I gave correct info to on night two. Uh, and then on night three, there was no correct or incorrect info because the spy was involved in the info. Uh, I gave Milk a yes because I was trying to uh, frame Patters as being a minion because a bunch of people thought that might be possible. Uh, Patters was the monk who protected Malachan every night. Malachan, our flower girl, got incorrect information on night two because they were poisoned by Ellen uh, and then legit info for the rest of the game. Aggie was the undertaker who correctly learned JC was the puzzle master. Sam was our farmer who at no point died. Ed was our steward who learned Resnora and Resnora was our amnesiac whose ability was... Each night, uh, you learn the alignment of the player who nominated the person that was executed. Uh, Resnora bags that on day three, and that just leaves Jackie, our seamstress, who got a correct yes on night one. And that yeah, was It Comes at Night. That's really rough. I, I, don't think chat, I don't think chat was there for it, but I had a great conversation with Ellen where I said, literally, if I'm sober, Sam is the demon, and if I've poisoned the other, Sam is the demon. And Ellen was yeah, panicking. And, and then it was like, <laughs> the barber swap to could swatch under patches, and I, just, yeah. I had to try and claim something. I mean, the crazy Rez thing is, there is, I, like, yeah. if, if, if the Kazali had chosen Aggie and Malachan, that would have been that game would have been the other way around in my opinion it would have been upside down oh, sure. and people would have been saying oh you should have put more you should have put more info rolls in the bag or something <laughs> yeah. but because it went the other way um it was yeah, yeah completely opposite but i think and like that is the that is the best example of the kazali i think we could have given now because you, you guys have seen it now uh, get demolished and you're going to go away and see it absolutely ruin teams of good players by, <laughs> by having a, a four outsider game where two townsfolk have become or the two most powerful townsfolk have become minions.